case I just mentioned before, if not more. Before I start cooking my delicious dishes, I want to introduce you this is the smart design of this wok. So this wok has uh, four pieces. The wok, the lid, the lotus blossom rack, and the spindle rack. So four pieces. This wok is designed very well because the lid can actually be installed like this for easy storage. Can be hang on the wall for easy storage. The knobs are heat resistant up to 200 degrees, so your hands never get burned. It has a flat bottom, so it's, um, it provides stability. And it actually is compatible with a gas stove top, electric, ceramic, and magnetic induction stove, um, stove top as well. So super versatile. So yeah, this article is all you need, pretty much. Travel at home, so that's all you need. So in terms of uh, the dishes I'm going to talk today, I'm going to have the Portuguese curry chicken, the steamed garlic prawn, and also the lamb cutlet in hoisin sauce. All Asian dishes, Hong Kong style. Mm -hmm. Hope you all like it. And I'm going to cook all this in under 20 minutes, okay? So the time will be. Okay. So firstly, I'm going to get up the wok. So the chicken has to be marinated with the garlic powder, curry powder, and salt. It's really quick, it's already heated up, so I'm going to add the oil in. Then the oil and put the onions, chopped onions in it. I'm going to saute it a little bit. And then later. Okay. And then the garlic powder. And then the chicken. Put it in. And then put some Chinese rice wine. <coughs> Well, there's enough alcohol in, uh, in a dish, right? Especially on Wednesday night. <laughs> so, also, also wine. <laughs> and I'm going to add the chicken stock. A little bit of chicken stock. Not all the way yet. Okay, so let's give it a stir. But almost immediately, I'm going to add in the okay. potato. So, chopped potato. And the tomato as well. Okay, so once you add the ingredients in, you can now add the chicken stock to make sure it covers all the ingredients. Okay? Okay, let it pour a little bit. Let me just close the lid. So I'm going to show you the first technology this iCook Walk has. So this iCook Walk is 7 times surgical gray steel. So it's a uh, slow heat really, uh, for a longer period and really fast to cook as well. So it's uh, resistant to corrosion, resistant to stain, and maintains the flavor of the food really well. Very easy to clean as well. And this one lasts a lifetime. So it has uh, three uh, aluminum steel bonded together, which allow him to be distributed evenly amongst the wok. So it's called Optitan technology. <laughs> So this way, you don't have to go to an outside restaurant and you see the wall, and if your arms will get cramped and really hurt. This wall doesn't have to, because the, the food cooks yeah, evenly amongst yeah. the wall, doesn't matter where it is. It's really fast to cook, so you save a lot of time and energy, and you don't get arm injury. <laughs> so while the chicken is cooking, then we go to the prawn. So I'm going to teach you a trick. So the prawn already uh, lay out here, so I have very, very beautiful. So here the wok. I'm going to uh, add some oil in and cook the garlic. But we're not putting garlic in the wok. I'm going to cook the oil first. Put the oil. And wait for the bubbles and smoke to come out. It's going to be tasty. You should take it up pretty quick. And the garlic's going to smell nice. It's going to smell good. And, and then also the smell not stay in the thing. Okay, you see the bubbles already coming out? It's so quick. You see the smoke come out a little bit? Then you stop the heat. Okay. Bam! We've got the garlic here. We just pour the oil 
of the garden and cook it. So what's this method? This method, you remember, overburn, overcook the garlic, or burn the garlic. Okay? So this is the corner. The corner. On the side. CJ should have it. Can we have some garlic for the pork and some garlic for the, uh, the sauce and the lamb later as well? So oh, that's interesting. The so wait for the... Okay, you see the smoke comes out? Then you cook the garlic, prawn. Okay, the steamer rack come into play here. So make sure this part is in the bottom, face in the bottom. And you put on the steamer rack. Then you cook in the prawn. And the same wall. And the same time, five to six minutes. And the amazing thing about the wok is that the flavor wouldn't mix. So you look at prawns, taste like chicken, or chicken tastes like prawn. It wouldn't happen. So now I'm going to cook the lamb. Uh, simply, the, the lamb I've been marinated with um, some pepper. That's all. Very simple. Let's see the wok. We just have to prawn the, the lamb on both sides for three minutes each. Each side. So wait for a little bit. Okay, yeah. So a bit of oil. And because the, uh, the wok uh, material is so good, you don't need high heat to cook the food. Uh, no, the medium heat is all you need. And the food will cook really quickly. So let's use a pump. And just prime the lamp. Yeah, I don't know. This is being recorded. <laughs> We're planning to share this with people <laughs> in the state. <laughs> yeah, we are. We're planning to. <laughs> You can see that already fun. You're not going to put it on the lamp. You're not going to put the sauce later. And then put the lamp back in the sauce and cook for a longer period. Okay? Can you see that on the top one? No, no. It's already heated up so quick. So now, we're going to put this on this lotus bottom rack. Only one. Yeah. On the wall. It's amazing because now what you can do is put the lamp on the rack for it to rest. Now you put other stuff in the wok. So when this uh, the ingredients which require different timing, you can do both things at the same time. That's the lamp. Really neat. And the good thing about the about the rack is that you can close the lid here to, to stop the food by uh, coming out. And it drains the oil. And then you can close the lid as well for quicker cooking. Okay. So while uh, the the prawn, let me check the prawn. Almost done. So let me just cook for a bit longer. So I'm just going to cook the sauce now while the prawn is almost done. So the sauce is very simple. So I'm just going to put some bit of oil. The rest of the garlic. And I'll show you what I mentioned before. This, um, this wok is angle curved interior side wok, so it's angle curved. So it's easy for, for stirring and removal from the food as well. So let's cook the, the garlic a little bit. A uh, few tablespoons of poison sauce. Poison sauce? You can get it in any Chinese supermarket. Four tablespoons. And water. So about 200 ml. So I'm going to move off your sauces, so make sure you have lots of sauces. So, 200 ml. And last but not least, rosemary. 
You're always a humble man. Yes, Mary. Okay, so Tom, take a look Yes, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. I'm sorry. Oh, it's okay. Take a look at that in. So the left, a soft sword, a soft sword is also really well. Okay. Okay. So this is the left side. Okay. So the right side is really well. There's only no. I like the coconut flavor, so I'm going to add coconut milk. Quite a bit of coconut milk in there, so let it cook. So, all these two dishes are cooking, I just want to mention uh, another technology of this wok, something called the vital lock. So, you see the side of this wok is specifically engineered, so when this lid closed, it can form a water seal. So, all the moisture are trapped inside the wok. So, the food itself actually it cooks in its own juices. You see this wok? It requires less water and less oil when you're cooking. So it saves a lot of um actually help to maintain the nutrients of the food. The food itself maintains its color, its nutrients, its texture, and it's a it's a, it's a healthier way of cooking. Conclusion. So my technology is very important for this work. So let's check the man. So that is done. Just turn off the heat. So we'll take the lamp out. <laughs> so I, I demonstrate here as well, actually, three different ways of cooking, right? One is steam, pan fry, and stew. In effect, this wok can do 13 ways of cooking. You can braise, you can boil, you can roast, deep fry, shallow fry, deep fry. Pan frying, yeah, I, I, I forgot the other one, but <laughs> it's pretty much of cooking, okay? So pretty much all you need is very versatile. And because it can actually be used on gas, electric, ceramic, and induction, it's just so good, so amazing. Okay? And I think I'm just going to leave this lamp, because the place not big enough. I'm just going to thicken the sauce a little bit. Let's heat up a little bit. I've got this cornstarch uh, mix which have to thicken the sauce. 
So while you add it in, I'm going to um, stir as well. So make sure when you add cornstarch mix, you make sure you stir continuously to load the medium heat so that the sauce thicken. So add a little bit more. Yeah, I'm going to leave that for the chicken as well. This beautiful sauce onto the lamp. Mm. <laughs> 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 I just love garlic and rosemary in the lamp dish. This looks so well. Mm. Yeah. And the second dish is done. <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least, it's actually my favorite dish. Oh, it smells so good. <laughs> okay, so you can see the color is a bit white, so I'm going to add a bit more um, color. Well, I think I left the best stage, doesn't matter. <laughs> but it still looks amazing. Um, I'm going to add a bit of cornstarch mix to thicken the sauce a little bit. and save a lot of energy. V for vital lock. So the moisture trapped inside, the food itself maintain color, the nutrients, and also um, it's just a healthy way of cooking. And then O stands for Optitan. So aluminum steel, three layers bonded together, allow heat to be distributed evenly amongst the wok, which allow faster cooking. Okay, so hope you enjoy my cooking show. <laughs> 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 